Marshall Lobestall filled in admirably to start, has run into some trouble since. And they run a fly sweep right away, so giving it to Marquise Wilson, their standout receiver. First full year playing here, and he's had a nice year running the ball. Small package, and here he gets the delay. And Galvin with a good bounce outside, crosses the 35. And a first down for Washington State before Keelan Johnson runs him out. From Berkeley, California, 10 yards on that game. Got hurt on the first carry of the 2010 season. The very first carry broke his arm. So he ended up getting a red shirt here. This play action, there's a throw to the tight end. Andre Lintz. Spread offense of Washington State. Galvin, nice job to reverse his field. And the Sun Devils, and that's going to be a trademark of any Dennis Erickson team. Some YouTube footage, was able to find it of him back in high school. He can run that ball. And there, the inside given. Washington State defends that well as they drop Cameron Marshall. You've got three of them on the field right now spread in this formation. They send Miles out to the right. Osweiler goes looking for Mike Willie, and it's broken up. And again, DeMonte Horton of Washington State. Loving their offense so much. Well, they run it well. Cameron Marshall, and it's strong. Here's this pass they love so much. That swing pass in the flat. Good run out there, but that's one of the Washington State standouts. Alex Hoffman Ellis. Point. No one Washington has to get his head around and find the ball. That was good for 31. Well, there it looks like Osweiler wanted to fire it out to the right flat to Miles. But Washington of the Cougars was there. So Osweiler just held the ball on it. Look at that bunch. Well, they had three receivers right now. Miles motions left. Osweiler can run. But there's Hoffman Ellis again with a nice job to not let Osweiler really turn and get much. He only got four. Halliday he is uh, a second year, second year in the program. First year playing. Is this a touchdown on his first play? Yes! Dreams come true! Every, every athlete's dream. What an incredible way to get baptized. And there's a terrific play. The drop Marshall for a loss. Boy, you talk about really getting this Washington State really fired up. Oh, Halliday stood in there and delivered a nice ball. Wilson. But with the touchdown catch, went over a thousand yards for the season. Look, I look for him to just feature Marshall a little more through this game. The last two weeks, each of the last two weeks, ASU has run for over 200 yards. There's that for the swing again. Now we've got a flag down the field after Miles is dropped. If that route works in cover two because you know the weakness of this cover two defense is the middle of the field. Double pass. Washington State ready, and they clearly have scouted. They were ready for that play to Miles. They've been ready almost every time. Yeah, they've, they've run it three times to Miles, trying to get him in space defensively. And notice the two high safeties. Watch crosser routes coming underneath to exploit that. There is. Oh, and Flugrad hangs on. Took a tough smack and hung on. Well, just like Akbar tells us, Deep crossing route, flew right, gets up, gets vertical enough to get into that open so spot behind the linebackers. You know, it's two prior games for the Cougars this year, but tonight the first time he really got some substantial outing early and threw a touchdown pass on his first play. And he's got a man wide open down the field, so Halliday kept himself alive and the just extending the play. To Barton, and one thing that we're seeing with Halliday is that the Cougars are able to strike down the field. Nice shift by Winston. He's inside the 30. And that's what we, we talked about the 
coaching them to cut north and south. Into his offensive coordinator there, Todd Sturdy. Meanwhile, Andrew Fernie is out for the field goal try. See, he's not quite as extreme a soccer style guy as other kickers, most other kickers, but that one is true. It's adjusted by the coaching staff at Arizona State. He got five yards. Now Marshall, this is the big thing. Arizona State has been a, a good running team. Obviously, Arizona State. It's Arizona State's gets in this area. They really like to find their, their guy, Mike Willie. But number six, DeMonte Horton, has really been playing physical one-on-one -on -one against these guys. And the Cougars break that one up over the middle. The other is, remember, that they had an injury to another linebacker, McGee. And Good players around you make you better. And McGee was maybe a better linebacker than Burfecht was. And because you lose that security blanket, a little bit of control and savviness, and that's understanding, watching a lot of field, knowing where you're supposed to be and where your fit is. Halliday got it away. And there's Wilson. Is that a milestone night? Over a thousand yards for the second season as a Cougar. And Arizona State brings six, so they beat him with a quick screen. Coach Parker called that perfectly. Ricky Galvin. The, the chess match is out there. That one, he just kind of threw it over his head, but that's how you play young and fun. On inside to Marquise Wilson. Brings it back toward the side and crosses midfield. The rounded around the offense and excited about playing football. an accurate strike to Karstetter for a first down. <laughs> At first, though? Oh, that scares you a bit. Yes, exactly. You see the game clock is wound under two minutes. This time, Halliday. Good protection finds Buck. And now, the Cougars. Back with that ball. Little puts a pop on it. Oh, little shoulder fake, and there's Wilson. What a gorgeous play. This is his fifth year at Arizona State. As Halliday hit as he throws one up for grabs. And Barton comes away with the prize. Well, not a not an advice. I want, I want to hear you throw, I want to hear you describe this one, big boy. The young man credit. I mean to throw that kind of ball under duress, didn't even see Coleman coming, and he got him. 44 yards, now they go back to Barton in the flat. He runs it down inside the ASU 30. They've been stopped on two straight runs. They'll fake the run. And the flat pass for the first down. So the play fake, and then a, just a dump in the flat to Andre Lentz. To the end zone for Wilson, again! the charm. Marshall got seven yards on the first down. Hoffman Ellis Blitz is picked up inside Gibb, but the Cougars cover. Dayon Buchanan up from the secondary to drop Middlebrooks. A good six yards. Cameron Marshall, who got hurt on the last Arizona State possession, has not returned. It is Middlebrooks carrying twice. Play that is a game changer at this point. Oh, and they jam up. Osweiler tried a quick snap sneak, and he didn't get it. Well, great job of penetration by the defensive line. They got under the offensive line for ASU. We're able to stop this short if they were appears. ready. Yeah. And so now Arizona State has fourth down. They've gone for it once tonight and been successful. They need every bit of a yard. Play clock to five. Marshall. That's 
The definition of a red zone stop. Rankin again. Great penetration. Got low. Got down into the feet of Cameron Marshall and stopped him. And with the with the rules of the game. All right, Wilson back in on a long third. Finally, Halliday's forced to go underneath, but look at Galvin. First down. What a move by Ricky Galvin. What about his defense? Just some of the, they're just been inconsistent at times, and that's what hurts you. Perfect comes up the middle. Ball thrown out to Carstetter. And Washington State has moved out from the shadow of their end zone at four. The Cougars. Second down. Four man rush gets through. Another big ball. Halliday amazes. Standing in the face of two people about to crush him. And he flings one up the middle of Barton. Coach Paul Wolf at this point because your team just can't keep it consistent for him. Putting it in there for him. Now Marshall gets to the middle and then stacked up. Well, the Sun Devils just lived this. It's a little right. That precipitation is coming down. Guys are starting to really check their gloves, trying to get their gloves in front of the heater. Well, this time Erickson cannot pass up the point, but the root misses. 21. What a third down convert, 25 yards on the play. Wilson, seven catches tonight for 194 and three touchdowns. Now they'll run Winston. And this allows the Cougars now to grind clock. You guys existed, at least until tonight. That's the test right there. You need to run the ball. They know you're going to run the ball. Can you get the yard? Yeah, it's an attitude play, and, and you just showed some attitude right there. Down between snaps. He's got plenty of time here. He snapped it there. He's still at 11 seconds on the play clock. And Karstetter, and how smart is Karstetter there? This is a guy who is a finalist for the academic Heisman Trophy this year. Well, let's see if he has one more play in him here. Third and eight. He goes for the big ball. That is a completed pass. Incredible. Marquise Wilson. Connor Halliday better buy him a coat. You watch this ball thrown into a small window. But what a job of going up at the highest point and grabbing that ball and coming down with it. Connor Halliday loves it. After that 29-yard game. scores you might call this the biggest touchdown in Paul Wolf's tenure at Washington State programs are built on moments an attitude run and reaches out with that ball and gets it over the goal line and plays on his part when that much of it is upside that's what's so impressive what can Miles give Arizona oh he stripped it the ball that's the dagger.